welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a wardrobe slash closet tour. So I'm gonna be showing you what is in my wardrobe and drawers and also how I organize it. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and let's get into the video. Okay, we're gonna start off with my wardrobe itself. So we're gonna start off with the top half of the wardrobe. There's also some clothes on the bottom part as well, but I'm gonna move on to that afterwards. So first of all, the top half of my wardrobe is full of my summer clothes. And as you can tell, they're all in rainbow order. So it goes from pink, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, white, black, and then black with other colors. And then just at this end here, I've also got some coats and things like that and jackets. So I'm not gonna show you every single item in my wardrobe because we will be here forever, but I'm just gonna pull out a few of my favorite items to show you. Okay, so here are a couple of my favorite items. And as you can tell, all except one are pink. So um, not surprised there though, because pink is obviously my favorite color. So this is probably my, my favorite item overall because this top is just, I'm in love with it. So as you can see, it's just a nice sort of like almost racer neck top, but not quite. It's just it's so nice. It's got sequins all over it and it's just like a baby pink color. And I just feel so great in this top. I just feel like me in this top. And this is actually, it was my Nan's, um, but she gave it to me because she didn't want it anymore. And she loved this top as well when she was younger. So um, she gave it to me and I love it so much. It also, the button on the back is a little pearl and I just love this top. Another one of my favourite items, again, is pink and sparkly. It's kind of like a rose gold sequin covered jumpsuit. And this was from Primark. It's kind of low cut, but it's just, it's just so nice. Um, I had a festival themed Zoom party at the start of lockdown, which I had so many amazing memories from. And I wore this and oh, I just feel so great in this jumpsuit as well, because again, it's just so me. Rose gold, pink, sparkly, sequiny, just so nice. <laughs> Next up, again, this was actually my Nana's as well, but she gave it to me. I wore this in the video where I got my hair cut, so if you haven't checked out that video, go have a look. And you'll see this top featured. So, it's just this beautiful pink, sort of kind of floral, but kind of not, top with slit sleeves. So, your arm basically like sticks out the side, but I just think that's so nice. It's got all of these silver buttons that do up at the back. I will admit the buttons are quite hard to do up on this top, but it's so worth it once you've got it on because it just looks great. The bottom bit is like really, really fitted on me. So then it kind of like balloons out at the top, which is just so nice. And yeah, this is from Miss Selvridge, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Miss Selvridge. <laughs> Next up is this pink Jack Wills dress. This is like a salmony pink color with maroon flowers on it and it's just gorgeous and it has pockets in it. Anyone who, oh, that's not the pocket, that's the zip. <laughs> it does have pockets in it somewhere though here. Um, so anyone who loves a dress with pockets in, this is a great dress for you. And they do this in like other colors and patterns as well. My final favorite item is this dress here. It's just this white dress. It is getting a bit short on me now, but I just love the style of it. It's kind of like an A-line dress. And then it's got all this beautiful embroidery along the top, which is just such a lovely detail. And oh my gosh, I love the contrast between the white and then all the bright colors of the embroidery. I feel so great. In this dress again. Next up, we're moving on to the bottom part of my wardrobe. So this is all of my winter clothes. Again, it's kind of the same organization method as the top. It's just in rainbow order. I don't have it in like sections of jumpers, t-shirts, crop tops, etc. I just have them in color order. And then that way I literally know where everything is. And say I pick out a pair of navy leggings, then I just look for a top that's gonna match the navy. Like I don't look in the black section or I don't look in the, I don't know, green section or whatever. I just find, look in the color sections that I think match the bottoms so again I'm just going to show you a few of my favorite items from the bottom section I obviously said like I said just have it in color order however at this end right here I have my sick form suits and this is a little sneak peek of one of my six form suits of which is like one of my favorite outfits ever that I would probably wear even if I wasn't wearing it as a sick form suit I'm so excited to wear it for sick form but I'll be showing them in a couple of videos time. I'm not entirely sure when the sick formal outfits haul will be up, but it definitely will be up soon because I want to help you guys out if you are looking for uh, sick form suits because I know that women's suits are so hard to find and I had such a hard time trying to find some suits and I've only managed to get a couple so far. Once I picked up the skirt that goes 
with this because I'm just currently getting altered I will be filming that haul and it'll probably be up this weekend or if not early next week these are a few of my favorite items from the winter section so I've got this yellow jumper that me and Megan have matching ones and it just brings back so many memories when I look at this jumper and wear it I have this one which again brings back memories of New York and that was like one of my favorite outfits I actually wore this the other day as well with my lilac check skirt and this is one of my favorite outfits ever then there's this jumper here I just find this so comfy and also it looks looks great with jeans or skirt or whatever and this is from Jack Wills and it's like really really soft inside it's kind of like a fleecy material inside then finally is this dress here this is also again like an a-line shaped dress and i wore this at my mom's party birthday party last year and me and megan did some dancing and this again brings back so many memories and i just love the subtle sparkles and pattern on the dress the final thing in my wardrobe is just these belts i don't really wear belts that often if i'm being honest but there's this one i got from Primark recently but it's still a bit big so i'm gonna get some new clothes to put in that but then i think that'll be probably the one i wear the most often at the moment it's these ones i wear the most they're also from Primark, but they're from the kids section because i really want my belts to be like super tight so i size down then this one is no idea where this is from but i'm pretty sure it came with like a pair of shorts or something and it's like rose gold sparkles i love this and then i've got random pair of socks in there that's not really relevant and that is everything inside my wardrobe so moving on to the drawers on the other side of the dressing room i've got things in the first top three drawers and then my mum has the bottom drawer on top of them i've got part of like a few eyeshadow palettes that didn't fit in my makeup drawer in here i've got this is more like nail stuff nail clippers files etc i have a picture up here and then in here i've got all my hair accessories all in different compartments like scrunchies in here hair bubbles in there hair clips hair grips and then those are like little elastic bubbles so let's start off with the first drawer so in this drawer i have my leggings and shorts so it starts off with like colorful shorts more cotton material shorts and then it moves on to all my denim shorts and then these are all my leggings in different colors kind of gets more colourful as we go along. My few favourite items in here are probably these shorts here, which have lace at the bottom. These are like my favourites. These are from Primark and I got these really recently, but they're definitely my favourites. I also have these shorts again from Primark, which are just like lace all over. And these go with loads of different coloured tops because they're white. I just love the look of the lace and the fit is really, really nice. They're so comfy and stretchy. And then finally, these leggings. These are from River Island, I'm pretty sure. And they're just so quirky. I haven't worn these that much out, but I definitely am going to in the future. So obviously one leg is white and one leg is black, but they've got the floral pattern all over them. I just think they're so cool. So moving on to the second drawer, this is my skirt drawer. As you can see, I'm definitely a fan of skirts. I have quite a lot. These are my everyday skirts on this part here. These are all my dressy skirts. And then these are ones that I don't wear that often, but I don't want to get rid of because I still like them. So uh, my favourites are this lilac skirt that I was telling you about earlier, which goes with the lilac fluffy cardigan. And this was from New Look. And I think I got it in the sale a couple of years ago. And it's just so comfy. It's getting a little bit short, but I'm trying to get as much wear out of it as I can before I grow out of it. <clears throat> my next favorite is this one. This has so many memories from when I did Adam's Family because I feel like I wore this to a lot of my rehearsals and this is from Primark. I just love the belt and the, the fact that there's pink running through it just was so great and then I wore like a neon pink top with it sometimes and I just think it goes with so much with it being black, white and pink. And my final favorite skirt is this one here. It's a floaty baby pink. I don't even know what style these are. It kind of reminds me of like a ballerina style skirt and this was from H&M a couple of years ago and I think they do it in a various different colours. I have it in navy as well and they're so floaty, you can dress it up, dress it down, you can wear trainers with it if you wanted to make it a bit more casual or you could wear uh, high heels with it and make it really, really dressy. The final drawer is my trousers and jeans drawer. So along this side here I have all my casual trousers or like my comfy ones, so like my joggers and then some stretchy trousers. In the middle I have the trousers, I don't wear that often. And then the ones on this side are all of my jeans. So I kind of know which jeans are which and these are definitely my favourites. These are my new ones from Primark. And they're my only pair of ripped jeans and I just love ripped jeans at the minute. I think they look so nice. And then my other pair of favourite trousers are definitely these ones. They're currently inside out. These were from New Look and 
they're from the kids section but I wear these I wore them on Christmas Eve when I went around Megan's and they just have so many memories again and these are the most comfy trousers you will ever wear these drawers have got not that much exciting stuff in them but I will show you bits and bobs from each so this top drawer has socks in it it's kind of overflowing and not really relevant don't you show you and my tights and I'm so excited because I'm trying to get some skirts that I can wear my colourful tights with this is going to be so much fun <laughs> wearing those and then these okay this is kind of weird showing you socks but these are my favourite socks ever I wear these all the time they're Puma ones and I don't know where you get them from but you probably get them online pretty much anywhere I wear these every single day I'm wearing them right now <laughs> I just wear them all the time because they're so comfy because they have this elasticated bit at the top they don't fall down as much which I find really really handy because it annoys me so much when trainer socks fall down in your shoes so these don't do that and they're so comfy second drawer is my underwear not really going to go through that because we don't need to the third drawer is my sports wear so I have my sports bras on this side I have my sports tops here um, all my vest tops here and then my sports shorts here some of them are like more comfy shorts rather than sports shorts oh and there's some leggings there as well I just organised this drawer out yesterday because it was super messy and I had some pyjamas in here as well but I decided to reorganise this just for sports wear and then vest tops because when we go back in September we're going to be, have to wear our PE kit all day at school if we have PE that day so I was like I definitely need to sort this out and then make sure I know what I've got to wear at school and the final drawer of these is my pyjama drawer as you can see I have a lot of pyjamas it's kind of a bit um, of an obsession buying pyjamas all the time every time I go into Primark I want to buy a new pair and I don't need any more um, I have recently sorted them out and got rid of some but you know what it's like so these are my favourites I've got this Disney nighty right here um, baby pink again this is from Primark I'm pretty sure it was £6 I usually wear these pink shorts with them these again were also from Primark, surprise surprise I've had these for years and again a little bit small and a bit broken and stuff because I've worn them so much but because they're pink they kind of go with the nighty. and then again with a similar vibe again from Primark again I have the same nighty basically but just in this turquoise greeny colour and this is my soul colour just gonna put it out there not gonna explain that in today's video because it's a long story but this is the colour I think represents me and my soul so that's why I love this nighty so much and also again it has so many memories and I wear these shorts again from Primark with it because they're kind of matchy matchy I have my Victoria's Secret ones as well which again are my favourite these are better in the winter in my opinion because because of the satiny material, they really get so hot. I get boiling in these, so these are great for the winter. And that is pretty much all I have to show you for these set of drawers. This is my last wardrobe um, and the last bit I have to show you. So if you open this up, I've got all of my dressing gowns and snuggly, comfy things inside. And then my shoes in the bottom. So we'll start off with this area. I have my Wolves t-shirt here. It's like a football shirt from when we did a play at school. Then I have, oh my goodness, I forgot to show you these pyjamas because these are in here. And unicorn pyjamas. Trust me guys, I wear these all the time in the winter. Can we just appreciate how cute these are? They're from Marks and Spencers and my grandma got me them and oh my gosh. Do you know what? I kind of forgot about these because it's been so long since the winter and now I'm really excited to wear these again. Can't wait till Christmas now. I can wear my nice snuggly pyjamas. I've got this really nice fluffy dressing gown here from Sainsbury's this is so thick I don't wear it that often because it's super thick and just too warm um but it's still really nice if you want a fluffy a dressing gown I have this jump here which John gave me years ago it says Brooklyn on it and it's just great oversized jumper do you know what? I'm kind of tempted to wear this out at some point um as a normal jumper because it's just so nice and comfy but if I'm just a bit chilly but you don't want something fluffy on that's usually what I throw on in the winter next up this is my favorite dressing gown ever to be honest I wear this one every single morning and it says get up and glow in it in the beautiful rose gold writing this is from new look I got it for Christmas a few years ago and me and my sister have matching ones then we have this robe this is actually Ted Baker I got this for Christmas um a few years ago I do love it so much I love the black with all the cherry blossom and beautiful birds on it uh, let me just show you the back it's so nice that kimono style the final department to show you is my shoes i actually just organized this earlier because it was a complete mess um they're not in any particular order whatsoever except for the fact that all of my flip-flops are over here folded up and my sandals i've got a mixture of just shoes everywhere i can kind of see what's in here now so now i've organized it 
So these are probably a pair of my favourites. I'm going to be wearing these for sixth form. I've had these for a couple of years. I've had two pairs of these, £10 from Primark, and they do actually last a fair while. And they're just so nice to slip on, and I love the painting. I love this. Love these shoes in general. Then we have my jelly shoes, which, again, I really love. <laughs> these are from New Look, and I got them a year or so ago because I was a bit obsessed with the idea of jelly shoes, and I've never had a pair before. I also have another pair just here, which are sparkly, but I haven't actually worn these out yet because they're not the most comfortable ones, whereas these ones are super comfy. I kind of stick to the same pair of shoes all the time. So my pink, my baby pink Vans, my Adidas Superstars, like the holographic ones, and they're kind of the trainers I stick to most of the time, so, and they're downstairs, they're not actually in here right now, but I would show you otherwise. And just a quick sneak peek into here, if I can even open it, because it's so jam-packed full, is this is my bags drawer. Um, so we've got like my white handbag, which I love. This was from Next. I think it was from Next. Either way, it's a really nice bag. It's nude inside. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this was Next. Uh, white snakeskin print on the front and oh my gosh love this bag it's such a big bag as well that you can fit everything in it and then this one i'm super super sad because this actually broke this was my primark bag and i feel like almost everyone has this bag <laughs> But it's been so great. It was my favourite bag ever. I almost used it every single time I went out. But the strap has come off, unfortunately, from all the use it's had. So I'm looking at buying another one soon because I just feel like this bag was the most helpful bag ever. I'm a bit of a sucker for backpacks because I just think they're so much ha handier than using a handbag because it doesn't hurt your shoulder and everything. So definitely recommend this from Primark. It's like £6 or something. I just feel like you can't go wrong with that. And it lasted me quite a long time. And that is it for today's video. I really, really hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and help me get to my goal of 1,000 subscribers. Oh my goodness. That'd be incredible. So thank you so, so much for watching. I will see you again soon. Bye.